Good morning guys, I woke up with the best energy today. You know when you have those days where you just wake up and then you don't even have to do anything to know that you're ready to take on the day. I have a lot on my to-do list adds up. I'm gonna just start off with a workout. Please ignore my messy bed. I haven't made it yet. <laughs> Oh my god, I killed that. Thank you, girl with Joe. You have the most fun killer outfit uh, outfits. You have the most fun killer workouts. Shower time. But first, I want to start off by thanking the sponsors of this video for today, and it is Daraz. If you guys have been following me for a while now, that you know how much I love online shopping, and Daraz is definitely one of them. I'm constantly buying all kinds of products on there because they have such a wide range of products, anywhere from beauty, electronics, gadgets, health, you name it. If you guys already didn't know, Daraz is having their Dasai Dhamaka sale. They're currently having mega deals, additional bank discounts up to 2500 off on prepayment. All you have to do is shop from the 19th of September to the 7th of October. So this sale has already started, guys, to be eligible to win the bumper prize TVS and Torque 125. Don't forget to leave a review on products that you love or you like. It really helps other shoppers like you to confirm an order. Personally, when I'm shopping on Daraz, always remember to leave either a review or a star rating so it helps other shoppers and it's super easy guys all you have to do is go to your account to the review section and leave your opinions about the products you can get a chance to win rupees 100 worth of recharge vouchers if you leave a review in the bottom they have all these categories to explore let's do health and beauty they have my favorite sun play skin aqua sunscreen also available Habo Labo, this is such a good moisturizer. Virgin coconut oil, ooh, I'm definitely gonna pick some up, but it's currently 860. I'm gonna add that to cart. You can see I have a bunch of items in my cart already. I was way too excited, guys, and that's why I wanted to share this Dasai Damaka sale with you guys. And you guys can use my code GLAM200 to get rupees 200 off a minimum purchase of rupees 2000 if you're a new user of the Daraz app. If you guys are interested, all the links will be down below. Happy shopping! I'm just quickly putting on some makeup because got the boy makeup na lako super natural look for today. If you guys follow me from my TikTok days, OG sunscreen. I just have some errands to run today to drop off Miro Lugaru to this place that alters clothes. I hope they do a good job. I've been putting it off for such a long time. I keep saying garsu garsu, but it's just sitting in a boca on top of my closet. But I thought ads are saying gonna put you. I'm gonna use this uh, Fenty foundation that I've had forever. This is the shade 300. It's their hydrating long wear foundation. I don't like like this foundation. I feel like it didn't work for me. Uh, it oxidizes. Ani, it's too dark for me. I don't know what I was thinking. Clearly, I'm like the shade pick or at Sephora. I'm still not wanting to um, throw it away. I'll probably give it to Mamu because she likes the darker foundations. I think we're the same shade. She might be alikati lighter. Yeah, not might. She is fairer than me. Mamute likes to look alikati like on the tan side. Eti ma bossy bunny. Like it's fine, but over time, like in half an hour, it's gonna oxidize. And if you guys don't know what oxidize means, it's basically like the foundation gets darker. So, I mean, I love Riri, but the foundation did not work for me. I mean, I might try. Uh, Arco shade, maybe that's the issue. I have to go to Mam Papa's house, mm, send off some packages for pretty please. I try my best not to wear makeup every day because if it's not necessary, like if I was just going to like run errands like I am today, I honestly wouldn't wear makeup, but because I'm shooting a vlog and I thought it'd be fun, um, I'm wearing makeup. But typically, if I don't have to wear makeup, if it's not an event or a function, I won't wear makeup because I just, like those days to let my skin breathe there's a lot of makeup products that are non-comedogenic and doesn't clog your pores whatever whatever when you guys can avoid putting makeup on it's like the best thing you can do for your skin other than sunscreen i want to thank you guys for the response of my last video you guys have been loving it i've been reading each and every comment you guys literally make my day you guys are so sweet with your words and you guys clearly love my dad. Don't worry, I've already told Azak Papa, you are 
starting to get a fan base hey online we have to shoot a video some of you guys were recommending maybe a mukbang with him um i don't know what else could we do we could do a mukbang we could do like a father tori challenge or something i don't know you guys let me know in the comment section what you guys would want to see and the thing is i know him he loves being on camera like he might say eh, i don't want to do it like but he loves it like i'm like kati chuti we've shot tiktok videos in the past and uh, astiko video pani how much you want to bet afne uh, part in the video kati chuti heriola i'm thinking like 50 50 times back to back sorry to put you on blast papa but you know it's true today is such a beautiful day the weather is so so nice i just I put a batch of laundry in. You guys must be thinking, Kyo, like every video, my laundry, laundry, got it out so when you so. But um, I'm a washing machine is super small, okay? It's only like five kilo ko. So, and yeah, I'm doing zanat ha, and plus cash, you towels and all that. So, chito, it piles up, and plus both of us, she stores, we uh, work out. So, I'm a gym clothes, obviously, we wash it frequently. So, it just piles up, okay? And I'm also working on a new lip gloss like i mentioned made a last vlogma i might do a poll on instagram pretty please go account ma to ask you guys what shades you're interested in and for the festive season i definitely want to do a gold color i think that'll be very pretty gold i think of like festive time bianate we had this recycling company that we've been using for like since we've moved here i think by the bus recycling because in New York, it's a law that you have to recycle your garbage, otherwise you get fined, which is, you know, a good thing. Yeah, when we came back and then, you know, there's not much of a new culture that it's like a law that you have to recycle your garbage. My Sanu Mamu told me about Dolko recycling. You can schedule a pickup for glass, plastic, cardboard, undaco crate, whatever you want. Electronics or linsa, just like I leave their website. In the link below because if you guys live in a household and your garbage isn't being recycled you know it's for free they come pick it up you can schedule the date what date you want them to come by and you can just accumulate your trash and um, they'll come pick it up and then you can also either donate it partially donate it or receive full cash for it they wait and think it, and like they're just a very nice um, team of people and I, I really appreciate what they're doing I also want to do a uh, maybe, eh? it depends how I look on camera because I'm still a little conscious about my little um, pouch, my kangaroo pouch. Um, Babu calls it a kangaroo pouch for my belly. But he says, like, don't worry, you get, your kangaroo pouch is getting smaller, Babu. But I don't know if I'm there yet. I don't know if I have the confidence of showing you guys my bod day on camera yet. But I'm planning to do a try on haul of the swimsuits that I have because i'm gonna be traveling soon and i just want to see what looks nice and what doesn't look nice so definitely don't want to over or under back that's for sure Scusi. so here's a little sneak peek of the gloss that i want to launch it's this beautiful gold shimmer buckle lip gloss um the only thing is that the gold pigment i look at the bottle bottom of the bottle my saddle and so but um if you give it a good stir it should be fine but this is the first formula that i was working on so it's not glittery enough i'm definitely going to add more glitter yeah see you can hardly see it just looks like a clear gloss and i only in person in real life it looks you can see the flecks of glitter hokey i know but i want it to be a little bit more on the intense side so many requests for an apartment tour and um i will i will work on that i don't know when i'll shoot the video but um i want to make sure that the apartment is clean and looks good not like that what is that that's a huge mess yeah, once it's like clean and a little bit organized it just looks like hammer apartment looks very like plain in the sense we don't have any artwork on the walls and it's not a very like personalized feeling but like i said in my previous video we're not allowed to um toko nails get to the wall so we can't hang stuff on the wall i mean we could get like wa not wallpaper like posters but um i remember when we were kids i wish i had a picture to show you guys we used to sleep like in the same room right and then we got bored one day and when we had like a stash of these like vogue what other, what else was it like uh cosmopolitan or kiki kiki theoki and then it was like obviously those magazines have a bunch of ads and like and like fashion and spo so Baini and i like cut out maybe a hundred uh pages and then stuck them with double-sided tape on the wall pure bitta was covered ke from from the top to the bottom it was actually cute it was very cute i loved it um and then as we got older we like kind of um got rid of it 
I feel like I've hardly ever stressed the importance of being hydrated. I'm sure you guys have heard it all your life how important it is to stay hydrated and I, like I mentioned in my last video this is almost one liter it's 900 ml a bottle and I drink um, sometimes three to four of these a day I just keep refilling it um, sometimes when I'm editing and like that editing that takes hours and you know like honestly it takes two days for me um, especially if it's like a long video and I have like a bunch of things going on I will have this by my bedside or wherever I'm working by the living room and I just will sip throughout editing and then that's a good thing like you want to constantly keep your body hydrated this thing keeps it cool cold and i oh, i can only drink chiso pani especially early with the weather being so nice and warm i can only drink like chiso ice pani like you guys keep asking me glowy skin custody achieve garnet and there's all there of course there are products on the market available that can help you achieve that in a chemical exfoliant and masks and sunscreen and makeup of course but internal beauty is so much more important if you guys don't take care of your gut your oh my god that was the biggest bee i've ever seen in my life it was like a little fuzzy teddy bear like the bushy hair kind of buckle Anyway, back to what I was saying was how important it is to take care of your inner health also. And then, of course, if you take care of um, yourself, you know, work out, eat clean, drink a lot of water, taking care of your mental health, all those factors, it'll really show on the outside too. You know, it'll just start like protruding on the exterior. I don't want you guys to feel overwhelmed, but like, oh my God, that's a lot. Like you're saying it like as it's so easy and I'm just listing tuk -tuk -tuk, like a list. I'm not saying like if you're somebody who struggles with healthy habits, then you know, start out with something small. As of the here, I'm gonna do a stretch. I'm gonna do start doing a 15 minute long stretch and do that for a week. And then after a week or two, start another healthy habit and start drinking at least three liters of water a day. You know, you can start incorporating healthy habits into your lifestyle and then Pachita you won't even think about like hey there's so much to do and like I feel overwhelmed and then there's exercise and there's meditating and it's honestly habit you just put these habits into your everyday life and then it becomes a lifestyle you know sooner or later but yeah that's my little tangent on on what what the uh, just healthy habits I guess one of you guys was like, oh, you don't even wax, kitty, you don't even shave your armpits or something like that. Excuse you, I am growing out my hair so I can get it waxed for my trip, okay? Mind your business. <laughs> okay, so this is the look. I'm just keeping it super minimal, super dewy, super natural. Let's move on to the try-on, if I do it. If if I don't, then you guys won't see it. Uh, not until my kangaroo pouch is a little the so I've just organized the swimsuits with the sarong that I would want to wear and then these like random ones that I've had for like literally over a decade. I don't even know if it'll fit me anymore. This cup is looking a little bit on the small side. Okay, this is swimsuit number one. Um, I love the neutral color. I don't have anything like this. I still have the tags on it because I've never worn it. I already know I'm gonna get questions on where it's from. It's from Pretty Little Thing. I'd asked my friend who is coming from the States to bring it for me. I'm um, so sorry that it's not from here and I can't like link it or anything like that. But if you guys could comment down below a good place to get swimwear here in Nepal, please let us know. One thing I don't like is that this looks very cheap. Like the yo rubber is sticking out. I don't know if I can cut it or fix it or stitch it or something. I love the color. I love, if you guys know me, then I love my neutrals, my nudes, my browns, my whites, my blacks. I like the fact that it's like a tie situation. I think that's very flattering so I can like wear it up here. If you have a little bit of a booty going on, I feel like your style of bikinis, the tie cargo is the most flattering because then when you pull it up like this, it just looks good. I would probably style this with peachy nude peach type of shawl. Um, and pretend it's a sarong so you guys can just get an idea So yeah, I'd probably rock it like this. You know, that looks super cute. Believe it or not. These are not sarongs These are Miroma Kushal Zaru <laughs> That she's given to me and she knows that I'm gonna wear it like as like a wrap top and There's this Instagram picture that I posted. That's totally Miroma Kushal and nobody would have guessed. So yeah I'm loving this. This is so cute this is definitely gonna get packed okay next we have this little black and white marble moment i love this i'm not sure that this cut type of cut is the most flattering on my body type i like more of the adjustable like i said side ko poko or like this okay, thal -thal. Where's that? Where's that? 
I got it when I was in the States. I've worn it ik chuti when, um, when I was in Thailand with my boyfriend and his family. It's a little bit more like, um, what's the word? Modest, because it's more coverage. It's tap up because it's like high-waisted type of vibe. And uh, I think this one is gonna stay home. I love the back, I think it's super cute, simple. Yeah, she's gonna stay home. Okay, I'm actually obsessed with this one. The color, the fabric, the everything. Like, it is so cute. I can't believe I haven't tried this sooner. Like, look at that color on my skin tone. Oh my god, I think I should buy only this color clothes now. Coral almost, orange coral color. I'm like, oh god, the material has the rib buckle, if you guys can see. Um, texture to it feels such good quality. It does not feel like it's from Pretty Little Thing at all. I still have the tag on it. The Thai bikinis, I think it is the most flattering. Ah, this one, I mean, without a doubt, is coming with me. I have this situation, and I feel like I could wear it in different ways also to like feel a little bit more covered up at the beach or whatever. Like, okay, not like that. That's stupid. It is like literally straight up a kurta go um, shawl, guys. Like, if you guys can't tell. But I loved the color of this fabric like look how cute it's like a magenta with um this orange this is my boyfriend's mom's shawl and she's not a shawl person so i thought i would wear it as a sarong so this one can be like a like a longer version since that one was like a skinny shawl this one the wait, can you guys see maybe i could do it like like that and then i don't know i don't know i'll have to like look online because it's but on pictures and stuff like that. Cute! Love! Oh my god, can I go on vacation today? Like, can so if somebody has like a pool in their house, or inflatable pool, boy, but anyway, so can you guys invite me so we can body kill together? <laughs> okay, the next one is this beautiful sage green. The camera ma ramri dekhi tina, but in person it's a little bit more green. I've worn this as a crop top in my Gokarna vlog. Uh, I just wore it with some biker shorts because the bottom is very high rise. Like I'm telling you, it is full on 90s supermodel type vibes, like where they would wear like a swimsuit this big, like eti matra. It is way, way too high rise for my taste. I don't think I, can, I have the body to pull it off. I do love the color and everything else about it. Like this is such a flattering cut. Like I own quite a lot of shirts like this uh, with the one shoulder peeking out moment. I don't know. I don't know if I'm like obsessed with this because of the bottoms only because of the bottoms like, I can't I cannot show you the bottoms on camera like it is way too high I mean I might feel comfortable in Goa wearing something like this but I don't know you guys let me know in the comment section what you guys think you can help me out in that department but for me it's a peepty peepty yeah okay on to the next okay the next one is the bikini I was telling you that I bought Literally, thus borsa a guardiola. So I was obviously a little bit more smaller chested back then. Since this trend of wearing the bikini in a awkward, like not awkward, different way is trending, I thought I would figure it out. And like, yes, there's a little bit of boobage action happening. Why not when you're on vacation? Swimsuit is actually supposed to be just like this. I ordered so many colors. I got one in neon at the time was the Mitsali Rati trend. So I got one in green, hot pink, and then I also got a peach like a coral peach and then a white one. I gave that white one and the black one to Shivi, I think. The black one, I can't find. The only problem is I can't find the bottoms. Like, they've disappeared in the move. They're in Mamu Papa's house or something. I don't know. I only have the tops. And I, instead of throwing it away, I was like, why not rock this thing? So, it's so weird to be wearing this it's like 10 years later. Since the bottoms China, I might just wear Mirio Green biker shorts that I have. It's like a completely different shade of green, as you guys can tell, but I thought it still looks kind of cute like to walk around the beach or like I don't know on the island like I think it'd be just fun because it'd be so hot that this type of look would be fine but not to wear in the water obviously because bottom sign which kind of sucks but yeah I kind of like this I actually bought this little chain thing um, it has like green beads with little daisies on it super cute I bought this from a local store yeah not Jiki. it's actually for your tasma or your mask so they stay on put like that but I was wearing it as like a choker because I really like like the green in it I might wear it as like a body chain here with the little green swimsuit have a little green on green on green moment yes love it 
that is the end guys i think i have the pink hot pink and the coral but um it's literally the same thing in a different color so i'm not going to bother showing you the only problem is because the bottom is not white i don't know what to wear tala um and like even with this one this is another swimsuit that i bought so long ago is like that brand i forgot the name already but the surfer surfer material what is that called wetsuit sweatsuit it's that kind of material so it's like super st sturdy um it's super cute the black and the pink and it's a strapless but i can't find the bottoms it was just like plain black kind of high rise so this one is also no i'm not even gonna bother putting it on because i don't have the bottoms for it and then this i think i'm gonna take I might take out the padding if my thing looks lumpy. It's because the pad padding is there and got the borsa ko lagi to padded basiko, so it's probably all squished. But I love the color on my skin tone. So yeah, I think we are done. I have some one-piece swimsuits. I probably take middle black one, uh, which is this guy right here. Wait, this is not the one. It's somewhere here, guys. But um, I have a black one just like this. It looks like a bodysuit super simple plain black i love it i've been working on my fitness and like you know try to make myself feel and look right so i don't think i want to wear um, i should bite my tongue i don't think i want to wear one piece this time around because like you know like i wear one piece all the time because i was always used to try to like cover myself and hide myself now that i feel a little bit more confident in my body like i'm starting to love my body the way it is so i'm gonna wear a bikini I'm so happy this is not TikTok. If this was TikTok, this video would have been banned already, but yes. Even this is a moment right here, because I have this like neon little snake. So cute! Okay, I'm done obsessing. First, I want to start off by thanking this week's... Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, allergies. Every other night